good memories. Actually, I have uh, for me it's like uh, two time first time because uh, my very first time was here with um, the team La Filière. I was a young kid driving in the Formula Campus here at the, this uh, huge stage here. And uh, yeah, this was my first impression, but then my real first 24 hour of Le Mans, it was uh, 2006 and uh, yeah, it was a real great experience actually, I have to say it was bigger than I thought and uh, for sure when you do it once you get addicted about that and you want to come back uh, every year again and uh, yeah for sure you want to be the best on it and try to win that race that's for sure the main target for everyone who is here yeah the feeling being in the podium i think the for sure for me the first time was the best one but each of them is almost the same or is the same because you know winning is so hard and then uh, winning at 24 hours or the, uh, especially the 24 hours of Le Mans it's never easy so when you get there in the end and uh, like we did in 2011 with just a gap of 13 seconds uh, of second place it was uh, amazing you know it was uh, I was actually speechless afterwards and I felt like being in, a he in heaven it was definitely my best moment in my career. Yeah, I like both kind of style of driving for sure. LMP1 lives a lot with the aero, has a lot of power, but the GT is quite tricky, I tell you, especially in Porsche corners, you don't have this much aerodynamic as you have with the LMP1. So it makes it not easier, maybe it looks from the outside, but it, it isn't in the car. Uh, and for sure, I think one of the greatest cars definitely was uh, the LMP1 car. I think 14-15, uh, this was amazing cars running super fast. And just like, felt like uh, being on rails. Yeah, I think it's the whole week, you know. I think uh, Le Mans is not only uh, one specific time, it's the whole week, which is a kind of pleasure. Starts already uh, one week before with the uh, admin check uh, uh, in the in the city of uh, Le Mans, and then for sure the, one of the biggest thing is always right before the the start. For sure, when you take the finish line, uh, and then and all the, this kind of pressure and everything sinks then really into you, and you can just can breathe out and uh, and uh, looking backwards of a hopefully great race.